GRT is attempting a massive breakout above a key area of resistance above the 0 0.1882 and the moment you manage to break above that key area of resistance with a successful retest then I will be expecting higher prices here on the GRT chart. At the time of this recording we are also holding above the 20 day MA and we have also seen a break to the upside of this descending trend line indicating a change of structure to the upside and in today's video I want to give you my breakout target areas and also discuss a negative structure that is playing out here on the GRT chart so make sure that you stick around till the end of the video and starting the video by first giving you a recap of what has been happening since the 5th of July when we saw this massive breakdown move giving us a low below the 0 0.1535 and after getting that significant low we started a very nice bounce to the upside obeying the ADO12 structures where we first picked in the formation of this ADO12 count 1 then we saw a bit of a breakdown move in the formation of this ADO12 count 2 into the minimum target areas for the second wave highlighted on the charts using this blue target area which is an area that we fully maximized and we saw a reaction of that giving us a bit of a bounce to the upside and this bounce to the upside I'm now terming it as an ADO12 count 3 to the upside which is what we expect after seeing a breakdown move in the formation of that wave 2 and the minimum target areas for the third wave can be given by connecting the trend based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that area 12 count 1 then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave giving me a minimum target area for the third wave at the fib level 1.618 and that perfectly lies above the 0 0.2219 and once we have a high in place in the formation of this wave 3, I will be expecting a pullback in the formation of this wave 4, then continue gearing up even higher in the formation of that area 12 count 5. And for us to expect those higher prices, we first need to see a break above resistance at the 0 0.1882. So the moment we successively manage to break above that key area of resistance, flip it into support with a retest then we can expect higher prices to the next key area of resistance at the 0 0.2118 and a break above that with a retest then expect GRG to fully maximize our minimum target areas in this web 3. We also need to have in mind that we can also get rejected at this key area of resistance and if that is the case then we first need to find support on the 20 day MA on the 1 hour chart and the moment we lose that then I will be expecting another breakdown move into this descending trend line that I have on the charts which can also act as support and give us another bounce back attempt a break of resistance and if the break is a success then continue watching for higher prices but the moment we get rejected lose the 20 day MA and also lose this descending trend line that I have on the charts then I will be expecting for a deeper pullback to the 0 0.17 where we have our next key areas of support. So those are the two possible scenarios that I'm expecting here on the GRT chart for the next coming hours. And that's all for this video and I hope to catch you on the next one.